Saying a few things from my exploration about food. Blood group diet, no carb diet, carb diet, milk diet, vegan diet, fish diet, egg diet. A picking and choosing and leaving and adding things from many different variety of foods. It's not bad. But what in doing all these things, we have a certain reason. And the reason is to make sure that we are in the best of condition. And all of these doings don't last. They are temporary. But if one can realize simply, how about if the stomach was a burning furnace that regardless of what you throw into it, it just burns it down. In realizing the stomach is a burning furnace, you stop running from foods of different kinds towards foods of certain kinds. Rather, you condition yourself in realization, not in trying. The stomach is a burning furnace. And regardless of what you put into it, it just burns it down. Metabolism is no longer an issue. Calories are no longer an issue. Indeed, the stomach is a burning furnace. But our lifestyle. And basically, the most important thing is our sleepfulness towards not realizing this what the power of the stomach and overindulging in all sorts of different foods have made us run rather than becoming bulletproof. In my exploration I have found that the stomach is designed by the very nature to be and do all things by itself. The design of the stomach is such that when the right timing is given to it, the spacing out of bricks, and then regardless of what you put into it, it just burns down. It is working at its most efficient. I encourage you to explore. Put away all knowledge that has been popping up in the pop culture of fitness world today. What cannot be sustained should not be started. What has to take effort and your willpower every single time cannot be sustained. But what is simply remains in realizing what is that the stomach is the burning furnace all matters of food until the day you leave this earth is settled for good this is a simple matter Shivoham embark on this adventure